With me on the line from Boston, where the Edmonton Oilers play the Bruins Thursday nights, is journal hockey writer Joanne Ireland. Hi, Joanne. Hello, Craig. Uh, we're coming off uh, a disappointing 4-1 to one loss to the Flyers uh, two nights ago. And uh, we'll see a few lineup changes tonight, Joanne. Yeah, um, a few lineup changes. Maybe we'll start with the, the forward to, you know, as a group in Philadelphia, produced a lot of shots on net, but um, came out pretty much empty-handed. So what they've done is, going into Philly, Dallas Aikens had broken up the fourth line, which really was a bit of a head-scratcher. That was one of their most productive lines behind their trio of Nugent Hopkins, Hall, and Everly, and moved Hendricks off that line and really, I think, found that it was not a smart decision. So they've reunited those three, so they'll be back together. And they brought in um, Ilya Pakarinen from the American Hockey League, and he'll skate with Mark Arcabello and David Perron tonight, which will be an interesting one to see how he's had a really, really strong showing in the American Hockey League, and they wanted a little bit of grit and some someone who can produce some offense. So, again, it's his first NHL game. He's only had seven games in North America after playing in Finland, so there's going to be some nerves, and I don't know how much we'll see out of him tonight, but um, interesting that he's getting a look. And then on the back end, uh, again, they're still trying to fill a void there left with parents who sits out another two games for suspension, and they've taken Martin Marincin out of the lineup. He's sort of been a little bit in Dallas Aikens' radar here in terms of not playing as Aikens put it, as assertive as he'd like. So he's taken him out and uh, brought in Keith Dolly from... He, he was recalled, so he'll step into the blue line tonight and play alongside Jeff Petrie. Ben Scribbins is drawing back into the Oilers' net following uh, Thursday's 4-1 loss to the Philadelphia Flyers, replacing Victor Faust, who didn't have a great game in Philly. Yes, uh, they're going back to Ben Scribbins. Uh, Victor didn't have the best nights in Philadelphia. Uh, first game back from his groin injury, and you know, two months since the game, he's given up a wrap around and kind of set the uh, wheels in motion for that game. But so Ben Scrivens comes back, and as as, uh, as we all remember, the last time we saw Ben, he was uh, given the puck away and turned into a three-two loss. So um, I'm sure he'll be looking for a little bit of redemption tonight.